Hey folks, Kevin here. Well, it's March 20th, 2019. I'm over in the northern lower workshop area, and this is a continuation of the wiring of the uh, workshop uh, as we progress through the whole process of renovating and getting a workshop up and running. And in the last video, I talked about installing these, uh, these outlet boxes, or receptacle boxes, four foot off of the floor. And, uh, and I ran the Romex wire. Uh, so these are plastic boxes with, uh, with Romex wire, 12-2 12, uh, wire, which is two conductor and one bare ground wire underneath this, this sheathing. And uh, two things that, well, one of the things I'm gonna do is start uh, wiring outlets, uh, installing the outlets in these boxes. And uh, so I thought I'd talk about a little bit about uh, what the code requires. So when within eight inches of the running length, so where the Romex enters the receptacle box, you need to have it secured to, to the structure. And so we're using these uh, staples to staple it, and I have it within just a couple of inches here. The next thing I'm going to do, and you can run, like right now I show in this box, two wires going into into the box you can actually have four you could have two wires in each one of these it still would meet uh, the code requirements so, so you could have four wires in this deep uh, uh, plastic receptacle box uh, but what i'm going to be doing next is i'm going to be trimming off this uh, this outer layer of insulation, the one that covers all three wires, the two conductors which already have insulation, one black, one white, and the bare ground which has paper around it. So what I used to do in the old days was either use a utility knife or a, uh, a wire, a, a outer sheathing stripper, uh, basically just a little little uh, triangular shaped tab that sticks out from a from an apparatus that goes around the whole wire. And there were a couple times that I actually, uh, I think what I did was I compromised some of the insulation by using that technique. So I'm gonna be using a, a, a tool to go ahead and, and take this out. But what I'm going to do is mark each one of these wires at least one quarter of an inch inside of the box. So I, I do, the code requires that this outer sheathing this, this yellow plastic uh, sheathing be intact at least to the to the length of one quarter of an inch within uh, the interior of this outlet box. So I'm going to go around with a sharpie and mark all of these, give myself a half inch or so. And then I'm going to pull these two staples out and uh, strip the wire the outer sheathing off feed the wire back through the uh, uh, through the holes in the back of the box and re-secure them with with uh, the cross staples then I'll come through and we'll we'll start wiring the the, the outlets in these uh, receptacle boxes so here we go
Thank you.